So, welcome to Pass the Stick again, guys. I know it's been a while. Um, it's uh, Mike, Seth, Brian, of course. Um, and we are playing Enter the Gungeon right now. Um, this is a little game that came out uh, in August. Uh, and it's um, basically it's just like a dungeon crawler game, roguelike sort of a thing. You go through and you get like random guns and stuff, and it ups your sure, player's you. ability. Nope. Go ahead, pick a character. Um, I don't think we went back. Yeah. yeah. You get you get better guns, you fight bosses. Um, it's just a cool, fun little kind of like indie game. I don't know if it's actually an indie at this point, but it's kind of like, it's got the pixelated art style, and that's what every like indie game is doing these days. So I'm this little you guy. Go, um, you just want to go up there to start a level. My PlayStation 4 controller has seen better days. Yeah, that is, <laughs> um, that's my original PlayStation 4 controller. I can tell. And it's uh, it's been through a lot. The the rubber is wearing off the sticks like nobody's business. So, do I? Ha so I, the second, what the second player has to be this uh, hooded person. They don't get yeah. to choose. Um, the co-op is actually kind of like lame. It's only couch co-op, and you are you serve as pretty much a uh, oh. helper <laughs> mostly. Look at the look at the way the gun moves around. <laughs> That is cool. Um, and yeah, to, to, you, know, you have to press the R1 button to shoot. You both have to go to the doors for them to open. Okay. And with the is this uh, unlimited ammo? Your, your first gun does have unlimited ammo. You pick up a better gun, there's no pictures. Okay. So this is the default, yeah. Oh. Of, you know, what, what am I shooting? Is this, uh, oh, it's a little suction cup. Yeah. Well, it's cool. Um, and Brian, you have a cookie you used by pressing R2 to agree. Oh, uh, Seth was dead. Yes. I see his body there. I was already dead. So now what? Okay. And now you just explore this little mini map up there in the corner. Let's see. You can go and shoot things and you try to stay alive. Uh, um, thing to do Seth's is getting that uh, ectoplasm on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that again. The bullets are shooting their offspring at us. <laughs> so assuming. It's weird when you so, die in co op, you can explode. Oh, okay, so yeah. I, don't, I don't have a cookie now. No, yeah, you, you start off with one. You, you've already used it. Um, so I have keep to. Keep exploring. Uh, you might find a chest that will uh, have Seth pop out of it. <laughs> okay, okay. But explosion. he can still haunt people, apparently. Yeah. The explosion takes out a couple of bullets. Um, it's like a little blank. You have these things with all blank. And you put the R and the L and R triggers in at the same time. And it uh, puts the blank out and that gets rid of a lot of bullets. And it's really kind of okay. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Auto reload? Auto reload, or you can press square reload. Okay, that's good. Oh. Okay, so um, we need to find the test or, or, or oh no or. Uh, I will pass the stick. All right. Let's reload this again. But yeah, you you get used to dying a lot in this game. I've uh. I've only ever made it past the first level with Jeff's help. But I'm getting better. The little bullets are so happy. I'm so happy that they're about to meet their demise. Where do they go? Oh my goodness, so it's like bullet hell. Also. Yeah, so there's, there's a dodge, you can do it, I think it's L1 or uh, sword, no, sword. Yeah. These were all there's, bench bullets from all the other games. And they're invulnerable from the first part of the dodge, so if you get a bunch of bullets, come in, you just push. Oh, okay, so you can dodge through shots? Yep. Okay. So not just avoiding them, because like, that was hard to do that, that wave of bullets, like, yeah. you should have dodged that. Okay. So is that guy's gun or sword a gun? Yeah. Well, Whoa. Yeah. shooting. Oh, 
The evil skull pops up and then happy bullets kill you. All you have to do is touch things and they explode. I like that. Yeah. Like Slayer said, there's nothing in any of them. Yeah, there, there really isn't. It's, it's kind of frustrating to get back to the end with like uh, some kind of hide out of here, but it still doesn't work out so well. No items? Uh, you get items from like chests and then from the store later on. Where you can buy things, there's a CD store like gold shelf that just popped up on top of your head there. That's the money. We've got 22 between us right now. Store from here. Oh, I need to, oh, you know, this is like one of those hard to master games. Yeah, it, it, there's some doing to it. Oh, you can use the tables? Yep, go up to and press X and crack them up and I'm dead. And we both died, we both died at the same, at the same time. time. Yep. So, I'm going to pass this time. Okay. okay. So you get infinite con uh, continues? Pretty much, but it, it, you always start at the very beginning, so uh, you have to go through like the whole game on one life if you can manage it. So it's almost like old video games. Oh yeah, yeah that's, that's, a, that's a new thing that's been happening a lot. Um, new games, they, they like to make it hard. Maybe blob. You have to try to play Mega Man still. Uh, on and off. It's it's like so hard. I remember beating Mega Man 2 though when I was younger. I got Mega Man on the fucking DS. The 3DS when it came out. Mm -hmm. That's the hardest game I've played in the It's insane. And I think how much you want to get into the like it was fun. Nope, it was just the first level. I've been getting farther through uh, memorization, but I still haven't beaten the game. Mega Man. Mine might have been Mega Man too, but whatever it was, it was way really above my skill level. Yeah, this guy has that uh, 1000 degree sword or knife. It's like one of those knives. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, or they have like five torches. <laughs> I saw Jeff watch one of those the other day. Let's see what this is. I love those videos. They put one on like a phone screen, I think it was like a thousand degree phone. Mm -hmm. Did nothing to it. It trips me out. A thousand degree knife. I don't know if it was like a thousand degrees, but it was well, a thousand they, degrees. They say it's a thousand degrees, and then uh, there's a video where they actually test it. Okay. So it's killed by an explosion. Here we go. That's what you gotta do is you gotta figure out your thing. Whether you're cutting stuff with a thousand degree knife. <laughs> seeing if stuff will blend. <laughs> I like oh, that too. Oh man, I love will blend. <laughs> seeing if things will waffle. See if things will crush under a hydraulic press. Yeah. yeah oh, okay, so I'm this guy now. Yeah. Yes. I, I saw... Okay, I saw... Ooh, I like your gun. The high pressure water... Cutting, th cutting through stuff, yeah. There's one with... Uh, Sulfuric acid on different things. Oh, nice. Like sponges and food. In this game, the guy just, uh, just is putting it through a human skull, apparently. <laughs> what is this? That's a little. Uh, oh, you can. Thing. Oh! Oh! Yeah, can oh! With it. It's it's damaging me. Yeah. Continuously. I died. I'm a ghost. Oh, no, when oh. you died. So how far have you gotten in this game, Mike? Um, with Jeff's help, uh -huh. to the third level. How many levels are there? I think five. I like how you said, with Jeff's help. <laughs> <laughs> like, with Jeff, I could get it kind of far. Right, well, Jeff is a much he's a seasoned, at this than He's I a am. seasoned gamer. Oh, well, that's me. Yep. All right. So if you want to try another person? Yeah, you want to totally. Marine? Now go ahead and talk to me. Yep, there we go. Into the gungeon. It's pixel it's pixel art, but it still has like um, new style effects on it. Like it has god rays and stuff. Mm -hmm. 
<coughs> I'll take your, your word for it, because I don't know what that means. It's like the rays that shine from the sun, mm -hmm. shining through stuff, or like light come off the candle and it's like coming through something. It shows the god rays, like when you're in the forest. Sun down. Like Maybe that's not what they're Maybe that's not what they're called. Yeah. Just because I don't know what this does not mean that it's not what it's called. Okay, so that little bar at the top of your head, that's your reload time or what? Yeah. Okay. Cool. But there is apparently an item you can get that uh, gives you active reload but can have a reload or war. Whoa, whoa! These little meat wad things. Yeah, those are like spell books, I think. Ooh. Get all hocus pocus on in here. Yeah, don't press X. Oh. Nice. That's it. Sorry. Whoa! I guess I'm Where's my my helmet? Your helmet? I like that. You got a black guy underneath. I like that in the dungeon, someone took the time to hang some gear head. <laughs> well, this is the library for the dungeon. Yeah, and are those, are those like telescopes? Yeah, there's telescopes and globes. Where are they looking? <laughs> Unless the ceiling's open. Well. And then you can just climb out <laughs> all of those ladders that you can't climb. <laughs> there are ladders you can climb. Oh. There's, nice There's a thousand degree sword guy! There's lots of nice little touches, like the frickin' uh, the door and all their enemies around, how the faces are Yeah, that's like a mob scene. Whoa, kamikaze grenades! Yeah, yeah. So is the second player shooting nerf darts? I mean, they kind of look like it, but they do not see no damage. This is my weapon. Mine's like a plasma gun, which makes sense, but it does kind of look like Master Chief or something. Master Chief, do not shoot. <laughs> much better like that. Like, I agree with your choice. I wouldn't want it either way. Master Chief and Raven from Two Titans. Playing on Is it? <laughs> you didn't know Master Chief was black. It had a bug eye. What is that? I think he's kind of being paid too. Yeah. But in player two is like a like a dungeon of pointing. Uh, player two. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, hey! Oh, I lost okay, yeah. Okay. Hit the pits. <laughs> That's what we've been talking about all the Pits in gun in the uh... <laughs> Oh! I can't I can't master that roll when that wave comes in. Yeah, it, it's uh, it takes some skill. I'm not the greatest guy either. I don't know if you watch any video, any video that I'm in, I always say like I, I'm not good at games, but I do like them. I agree. I like it. Ghost Mike? <laughs> can, can you do some damage or? A little bit. Uh. Like also block the bullets. So if I can get the two two, I can get the out there with my little wave. Uh, oh. What the? Yeah, there's still some window. Let's see if I can oh, just... Oh, look, we're still going. Bye. Bye. Bye, guys.